Brought to you by wikivd.com Martavis Bryant Martavis Bryant is an American football wide receiver for the Pittsburgh Steelers of the National Football League. He played college football at Clemson and was drafted by the Steelers in the fourth round of the 2014 NFL Draft. High School Career In high school Bryant was a standout football player for two schools. He attended Calhoun Falls High School in South Carolina and transferred to T.L. Hanna High School in Anderson, South Carolina prior to his senior year. He was named first-team All-State as a senior recording 70 receptions for 722 yards and 11 touchdowns. He had 44 catches for 776 yards and 6 touchdowns as a junior. Considered a four-star recruit by Rivals.com, he was rated the 10th best wide receiver prospect in the nation. After high school, he spent one year at Hargrave Military Academy in Chatham, Virginia in order to pass NCAA initial eligibility standards as a standout sprinter Bryant ran for the TL. Hannah Track Team He finished second in the 100 meters at the Regional Class 1 AAA Championships. With a time of 10.85 seconds, he also won the 200 meters at the 2010 Region 1 4A meet, recording a personal best time of 21.46 seconds. Freshman season Bryant began attending Clemson University in 2011. Coming into Clemson he had to compete with future NFL players Sammy Watkins, DeAndre Hopkins and Jaron Brown. His first reception was for 54 yards against Troy on September 3. The next week he had his first career touchdown a 54-yard reception while playing Wofford. His first career start was against Zero Virginia Tech on October 1, 2011. He, he also played in his first bowl game against two West Virginia in the Orange Bowl. In that game, he caught two passes for 20 yards. He completed his first season with two starts in 14 games. He finished 2011 with nine receptions, 220 receiving yards, and two touchdowns. Sophomore season After his first season he would begin to play in more games. Against Ball State, he would have a 22-yard touchdown catch, a 17-yard carry, and three kickoff returns for 69 yards. He would finish this game leading the Tigers with 108 all-purpose yards. For the season he would show little improvement having career highs with 10 receptions, 305 receiving yards and 4 touchdown catches. He would lead the entire FBS with 30.5 yards per reception. Junior season His junior season would mark the best year in his college career. While playing against Georgia, he recovered the game-winning onside kick. Against North Carolina State he had six receptions, for 73 yards. On November 14 against Georgia Tech he had a career-high 176 receiving yards, on five catches for one touchdown. In his second Orange Bowl against Ohio State he had three catches, 28 receiving yards and two touchdowns marking a career-high. He finished 2013 with 42 receptions. 828 receiving yards and 7 touchdown receptions making his career total 61 receptions, 1,354 receiving yards and 13 touchdowns. Bryant announced on January 5, 2014 that he would forego his senior season and enter the 2014 NFL Draft. Professional Career Coming out of Clemson Bryant was projected to be drafted anywhere from the second to fourth round. By the majority of NFL analysts and scouts, Bryant received an invitation to the NFL Combine, and completed all the required combined drills and positional drills for team representatives and scouts. On March 6, 2014 he participated at Clemson's Pro Day and chose 
who only perform positional drills. He was ranked as the 14th best wide receiver prospect available in the draft by NFDraftScout.com and was ranked the 13th best wide receiver by NFL analyst Mike Mayock. The Pittsburgh Steelers selected Bryant in the fourth round of the 2014 NFL Draft. He was the 19th wide receiver selected in the 2014 NFL Draft. On June 9, 2014, he signed a four-year contract with a team worth $2.659 million with $439,220 guaranteed and $439,220 signing bonus. 2014 season Bryant spent the first six weeks of the season inactive due to a shaky training camp and preseason in addition to suffering a mild AFC sprain in the last preseason game. Head coach Mike Tomlin told Bryant he wanted to see him dominate the scout team in practice before he would activate him. For a game Bryant was finally activated for a Week 7 matchup against the Houston Texans. His first career reception went for a 35-yard touchdown and he finished the game with two catches for 40 yards. On October 26, 2014 he hauled in a season-high five catches for 83 yards and two receiving touchdowns in a 51-34 victory over the Indianapolis Colts. On November 2, 2014, Bryant received his first career start against the Baltimore Ravens and ended the game with three receptions, 44 receiving yards and two touchdown receptions. During a Week 10 contest at the New York Jets, he had four receptions for a season-high 143 yards and had an 80-yard touchdown catch. This marked his sixth touchdown in first four games, and became a record number of touchdown receptions a player caught in first four career games. On December 28, 2014 he caught a 21-yard touchdown reception in a 27-17 win. Over the Cincinnati Bengals, he played in his first career postseason game on January 3, 2015, against the Baltimore Ravens. He finished the 17-30 loss with five receptions, 61 receiving yards, and a touchdown reception. In his rookie season he had a total of 26 catches, 549 receiving yards, and eight touchdown receptions in 10 games and three starts. Bryant's 21.1 yards per reception ranked number one among NFL wide receivers in 2014. 2015 season on August 27, 2015 Bryant was suspended the first four games due to violating the league's substance abuse policy. During his suspension, he spent time at a rehabilitation center in Houston, Texas and worked with ex-NBA coach John Lucas. Although he was available to return for Week 5, he missed the game due to a knee injury. He made his 2015 debut on October 18, 2015 in a 25-13 victory over the Arizona Cardinals. He caught six passes for 137 yards and two touchdowns including an 88-yard touchdown. His first start of the season was on October 25, 2015 at the Kansas City Chiefs, and in his second game he caught three receptions for 45 receiving yards and a touchdown reception during a Week 10 matchup against the Cleveland Browns. Bryant had a season-high 178 receiving yards on six catches while also scoring a 64-yard touchdown. On December 13, 2015 he caught a season-high seven receptions for 49 yards in a 33-20 victory over the Bengals. In Week 15 he made a season-high 10 catches for 87 yards in a 34-27 win over the Denver Broncos making it the first time he caught over nine passes in his career. On January 9, 2016 in a wild-card round playoff game while in the red zone, Roethlisberger threw a pass into the corner of the end zone intended for Bryant. During the process of the catch Bryant did a front flip and maintained control of the ball while holding it on the back of his leg throughout the flip. This score gave the Steelers a 15-0 lead en route to winning the game 18-16. 2017 season On April 25, 2017, 
Bryant was conditionally reinstated by the NFL. He entered the regular season the starting wide receiver alongside Antonio Brown. In the Pittsburgh Steelers' season-opening victory against the Cleveland Browns, Bryant caught two passes for 14 yards. The following week, he caught three passes for 91 receiving yards and his first touchdown of the season on a 27-yard pass from Ben Roethlisberger as the Steelers defeated the Minnesota Vikings 26-9. Personal life Bryant was raised by his mother Roberta Bryant. She worked at a textile plant while taking care of him by herself and help from his grandmother. Clemson began recruiting Bryant when he was a freshman in high school. He verbally committed to them in during his sophomore year of high school. Martivis attended Hargrave Military Academy in Chatham, Virginia and credits that experience for helping him mature. His mother says him attending Hargrave was a blessing. Bryant has two daughters, Brooke and London, and a son, Cal, with girlfriend Deja Hyatt. He also has amassed many tattoos, including the NFL Shield logo on his abdomen, to remind him he was drafted in the fourth round and to keep himself motivated. Brought to you by Wikivd.com. Would you like to?